Yo guys, this is just a quick video explaining the new solo leveling update coming this weekend. Oh well, it's supposed to be this weekend, but it might end up being like a Monday update again if it's not releasing tomorrow, which is Sunday. So I do have some sneaks that we can quickly look at. Alright, so the only confirmed character we have right now is Jay Hey In or something i'm sorry i don't know how to pronounce these uh korean names it's i just don't know how to but yeah it's like jay hey jay hey in or something she's a pretty cool character uh i didn't watch the anime and i don't think they showed her much well i did watch like the first episode of the anime and then the last two because i have already read the manhwa so i just wanted to see what all the hype was about at the last episodes but yeah she's a pretty cool character nothing too crazy but we do have this new fast banner setting and I'm not gonna lie, this thing is kind of useless. I mean, we can take a look at it quickly here. It's like, it's basically just going quicker than usual if you summon on the banner. But at the same time, it's not really because the current auto cell already skips the whole animation. So if you just put on auto cell, it's gonna be so much quicker. So you can turn on fast banner here. And he also has auto cell on, I think. So he summons and it auto sells 10 units but you still have to go through them so maybe this means that they're just making the summoning longer but you have to or well they're making it faster but you have to look at all the characters it's not just gonna skip all the rares and epics which in my opinion kind of i don't know i'm not a big fan of that but yeah it's it's something i guess then we have these titles here oh yeah we also let's quickly take a look at this first there's a bit more hype we have Sung Jin Woo, who, I mean, I guess this, I mean, it is a solo leveling update, so of course Sung Jin Woo is going to be in it, but yeah, this just confirms it. And we also have these titles. We have Summoner, which I actually don't know what that could be. Summoner. Oh, okay. That's probably like if you spend like a certain amount of emeralds on the banner. You'll get this summoner title. Shadow Monarch is probably when you complete a either a certain amount of the new portals coming or if you get Sung Jin Woo and involve him. Then we have the tester, which is a pretty obvious one. I mean, that's just for testers. The Shinobi, I'm not really sure what that could be. Oh, yeah, that's probably infinite mode. So, like, Ghoul Hunter is from the Star Mansion Infinite, and Shinobi is probably from the Naruto Infinite. Now, I don't think Wave 15 is going to be where you actually get it. If it is, <laughs> then the title is kind of pointless. I mean, you can do that with rares, nearly. I mean, you probably can, not gonna lie. So, hopefully, that's just a placeholder right now, and they're going to change it to, like, Wave 100 or something, at least. But, yeah, I mean, that's basically all the sneaks we don't have too much yet also this model looks pretty good i really like the 3d clothing in this game now i'm pretty sure we will get the portals of course i mean it's a solo leveling update this has to be a portal update but i think this one will have a secret portal compared to the other one that we got with one punch man where you just got boros from tier fives yeah i think it'll be like the valentine's day update one where you had to get the secret portal to get yuta well you could get yuta from a portal and from a tier five i got him from a tier five actually i never got the portal hopefully it's also a new type of portals i don't really like how they just reuse the same ones I mean, this is the Valentine's portals. They didn't even change the Valentine's Day design. You can clearly see that this is like pink, like Valentine's Day. And those are the ones you use for this one too. I like how they're in order now though. I didn't really think about that. Also, like they really got to fix this lobby, bro. This grass is so goofy. They used to have like some stone here to cover it. Also some like something here to fill it up because there's literal holes in the ground. I can probably get down here. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Great lobby, bro. Now, I'm really hoping they add some kind of, like, relic thing or something for this new update. Like, Sung Jin Woo's swords or something as a relic. Or just an event shop or something. I'm not gonna lie. The One Punch Man portals were just kind of boring. They didn't really have anything special. And there was no, like, event shop or anything. But yeah, that's, like, the sneaks and what we know so far. And then just what I think is gonna happen. I have a lot of work this weekend. So I can't really do, like, a long video where I have to edit a lot and stuff. I should be ready for a bunch of content when the update drops though so thank you guys for watching